Hey, hope you guys are doing well. Edgar's from Solo Marketer here. In this video, I want to quickly show you how to create a double opt-in form uh, on system.io. So obviously what you need up front is like a lead generation funnel or basically like a landing page with a thank you page, right? Where you collect your name and email address. In this one, it's really simple. Uh, essentially, you just have like a like an email input form and the button that's uh, connected to like it submits a form once people click on it. So when you click on the button, by default, it's a single opt-in, which means they sign up and they get added to your mailing list. But if you want to make a double opt-in, let's say you get a lot of bot uh, emails, like people signing up with like, you know, it's just basically a lot of lower quality leads that you don't want on your mailing list essentially what you want to do is you want to do double opt-in right you click on a button and over here you see do you want to enable double opt-in for this form or on this form you click check and then you save the changes and then the second thing you want to do is once you go back you want to go to settings over here settings and then you want to go to emails over here on the left side and then we scroll down obviously you need to have these the sender name sender email test email have those obviously in place but also over here double opt-in you can edit the email i would keep this line but you know you can add more stuff to it like i don't know all the best right have a signature have like a kind of a an email that looks more like an email this one just kind of you know it's kind of bland but you can keep it this way but I would recommend just adding a little bit of, of your own personality to it. Nothing too crazy. A few sentences, maybe. And obviously, you can edit the subject line here as well. And the sender name and email, which can be edited in the settings as well that I just showed. Uh, obviously, you can do like, hey, first name, right? The custom field, and it auto-populates with your name. Like, you can do all this stuff in the email. You can edit it. And in the end, you can click save. And then the last thing you want to do is you go to funnels. You go back to that funnel. You want to test it out, right? You want to test out the page. Over here, we open the page, put our funnels. Let's just do like a different one just so it adds a new lead. Get the book over here. And then let's go back to contacts. Oh no, first we go to check the email. We have to do the double opt in, right? Click on the link. So let me open email. So over here, the email just came in. So what I need to do is just click on the link. And confirm your registration. Registration has been confirmed. So let's go back and check the contacts check the contacts and over here we have a new lead only now it got added and now we can send them emails right so this is like an extra layer you'll get less leads but they'll be much higher quality because they actually you know follow through so this is kind of a uh, good thing when you want to battle like a lot of just low quality leads that just just yeah that don't amount to anything really this is like an extra layer of security and also for the page that i just showed you if you want to have a similar one like this, just a free template, if you want to claim it, and obviously edit it, make it your own, right? But it's really simple. It comes with like an explainer video. You can check below. There's a really similar one to this one. Actually, I like it better than this one. Uh, there's a free landing page template. I think it also comes with a welcome email template. And obviously with the explainer video that I mentioned, check it out below. And obviously like and subscribe, all that YouTube stuff. That helps a lot. And and yeah, if you have any questions, comment below. But if you don't have any questions, claim the lead generation template below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.